Hello, I'm the Twit Gamer, and we're going to be doing a let's play of Cyber Dimension Neptunia. Four goddesses online. Right, a bit of housekeeping, obviously. Number one, thank you to Idea Factory International for sending me a code for this game, but opinions, etc., are indeed my own. And number two, will I be doing a let's play of Cyber Dimension? I hope this answers the question. Anyway, we've got no config or anything. We, we've got nothing. I've already been through the start to get to the, to the config because I know I can't change the volume, etc. at this point. So I'm going to see if it's actually had an effect when I start a new game. I turned the volume down for the background music. I don't know if that's going to work. We'll see when we start a new game now. Please select your preferred voice option. This can be reselected in the config menu. English. Definitely English. Want to hear Noir's new voice? Game industry. A world that exists in a dimension other than our own, where the four goddesses watch and rule over their nations. Last station. The nation ruled by the goddess Blackheart. Only this time with a different voice. Loe. The nation ruled by the goddess Whiteheart. Leanbox, the nation ruled by the goddess Greenheart. And Planetune, the nation ruled by the goddess Purpleheart. Though the nations faced the threat of destruction many times, the four goddesses have always banded together to defend game industry. Usually from R4. In their current adventure, however, they have been selected as beta testers for a brand new online game. That game is called... Is he not gonna tell us? Alright, see you later, epic voice guy. taking a break from my work. I'm supposed to play this game with the others today. But where are they? Whoa! Right on cue! Hey! I'm over here! Well, I can actually hear the voices. So it, it does seem like the background music has gone to my configuration and it's half the volume because it was very, very loud. I could barely hear anyone. But anyway, let's let's get to what we want to hear, which is Noir's new voice. You're early, Neptune. I didn't think you'd be the first here. I, th I still feel I need to turn down the volume of the music a bit. That's assuming it is actually taking effect of what I've done. But with Noir's voice, it, it's... I think it's Eren, isn't it, from Fairy Fencer? Which I could get used to. That seems fine. That's, that's a good choice. That's a good choice. No one's ever late when it comes to playing a new game. No, I, I, I don't think the sound settings that I gave it have actually remained. Ah, well. Blonde, you're a priest? Oh, wow. It's giving me goosebumps seeing you in that outfit. This is incredible. Well, I usually play DPS characters in games. So I thought this might be nice for a change. Yeah, I can relate to that. I always play DPS. Hey, um, so what about my outfit? Ooh, you're a black knight noir? <laughs> Interesting choice. Are you burning hot with rivalry against me, the noble paladin? I just have to say, after playing the original Neptunia for a while now, it, it's nice to have the more update 
Neptune voice once again. It's, it's pleasing to my ears. It's not like that. But there's no way I'd lose to you when it comes to playing an online game. Goodness, everyone is here already. I apologize for making you wait. Hey there, Vert! We all just got here. Don't even worry about it. It's really bugging me now with how quiet their voices are, or how loud the music is. It's like, why would you not give me a config option at the start of the game to change that? What class are you? <laughs> that outfit looks so elven. <laughs> I have chosen the Enchanter class. It is the only class that bestows attributes upon players depending on the situation. Oh, so you're you're the buff character, okay. Your weapon's a rapier? In real life, Noir has a sword, and you have a spear, but here you've switched. At least they acknowledged it so fast. It would seem everyone has changed quite a bit in our short time here. Looking at the balance of our classes, we should make a splendid party. Alrighty, now that everyone's here, I guess I'll introduce these three here to you guys on the other side of the screen. She's, she's breaking the wall so much already, so much. This girl's Noir. She's the goddess of a little nation known as Dun 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 La Station. It's so good to have the modern nap. She's usually a bit of a loner, but since she's in our party, I guess she doesn't have to be so lonely this time around. <laughs> Way to go, Noir! You know what would have been good? If, if they added a line that just referenced the fact her voice had changed, it would have been nice. Just something. When all is said and done, Noir's sassy wit is a great foil to my finely tuned sense of slapstick. Please, take care of her, everyone. I will try. Ahem. Up next is Blonde. She's the goddess of a nation full of snowy wonder. The land of white serenity. The wintry, the wonderful, the lovely Loe. Like, Melissa's really having so much fun with Neptune at this point, isn't she? She's a shy, homely girl who loves to read. But once she loses her temper, she's unstoppable. Also, she's occasionally frustrated with her shortcomings in the, um, chest area. <laughs> but it seems like her loyal subjects are fine with that. More than fine, I'd say. Last up is Vert. Even if she might seem like the calmest of us four, she's a super hardcore gamer. A cut above the rest. By Jove. As you can see, she's got a lot of, um, volume. She acts like her older sister sometimes, but she's actually the only one here without a sibling. Yes, yes, we know that all too well. But anyway, this here lady is also known as the goddess of Leanbox. Please, give them all your support. Nah. Hey, who are you talking to? Me. And I thought I heard something about being lonely. Hey, what's this about shortcomings? Oh, I, I like the raspy voice she had then. A sister? Did you mention something about me having a little sister? No. Huh? Y you're just imagining things. You guys are so silly. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me of the, um, oh my, how lewd laugh. chit-chat and finish up these tutorials. Oh, hey, there's a sign over there. Ugh, where do you think you're going? Don't run away from me, Neptune. See, if you just change that to Fang, it, it's the same in my head. It's going to be really hard to separate the voice from it being Eren, because I really liked Eren, and I liked the voice she did for that, so it, it's going to be really hard to separate it, but I think I will. I don't know at this point. We'll see. Neptune. I would like to try the combat here as soon as possible. Come now, Blonde. We should catch up to them. I have to wait for the subtitles. It's like, come on, we got we ain't got all day. Good grief, it's like this every time. 
Normally, our nations compete against each other, but in this world, we can actually have fun and play together. The party shares a common destiny. There will be no rogue players. We work together. I will personally lend a hand if anyone needs help. She said that very weirdly. It's like, there will be no rogue players. It's like, okay. person I'd suspect of being a solo player and running away from the party. Again, gotta wait for the subtitles. It's like, I really need to get to the options as quickly as possible. Yep, I agree. Exactly. I see Blah needs to get to the options as quickly as possible. I'm not sure if I'll be able to keep up with your playing style, Vert. I don't really do all-nighters, so I'll leave that to you. <laughs> not to worry. Just this once, I will not concern myself with completion or ranking lists. Really? But complete. You gotta get it. 100%! 100% for it! Come on! I will simply and sincerely explore this new world. I will make new friends and tell others about this wonderful new game. Indeed. That is my responsibility as one who received an early access invitation from the Four Goddesses Online Management. I take this seriously. Is, is is that sort of like Idea Factory telling me like, right, take this seriously here, right? We've given you this, all right? Take it seriously. It feels like they're telling me, like directly to me, like, all right, I got it. Thank you for the code. Chill. I'm shocked that MMO Monster Vert isn't going to try and be a top ranking player. Seriously, I can't believe what I'm hearing. Somebody pick my job off the floor. Well, playing casually would be a good break from work. And this doesn't feel like a game meant for competition. I can respect that, Vert. I'd completely forgotten, by the way. It's just entered my head again. The sprites aren't moving, are they? I, I forgot that aspect. It, it, but after playing again the original Neptunia, I'd sooner have this than wait for a sprite to load. Thank you, Noir. That being said, let us let loose and enjoy ourselves. Indubitably. I believe this episode will take place on a different stage than the one from the previous Four Goddesses Online. I am exploring this world for the first time, and along with all the other beta testers, I am beginning at level one. I am so thoroughly excited. Yay. I know how she feels. The event point for the tutorial. Wow, what a beautiful view! It's so inspiring. It's just like if we were out sightseeing in the real world. Our new adventure is about to begin. Now then, everyone, let us move on towards the new horizon of Four Goddesses Online. Vert is really into this. Yeah! Yeah! Woohoo, I guess. All it misses is a, um, engorged D. Now that we've seen this super cool opening, the game's gonna start. <laughs> it's been a while since I've played an MMO. I wonder what kind of story this one has. You said this episode takes place on a different stage. Okay, then tell me this. Are these dungeons not like the ones in the normal Four Goddesses Online verse? Yes, that is correct. This land is completely new to me, and I have been looking very forward to the element of discovery in this game. An untouched land that stretches out as far as my eyes can see. Ah, oh, I cannot wait! These kinds of games are the most fun! We'll meet all sorts of new people, too! <laughs> I totally agree. The best part about being online is being able to make new friends. I only play with close friends, but perhaps if I feel like it, maybe I'll try feeling other players in this game. I'm sure we're going to run into other players up ahead. All right, let's keep moving on. Maybe she will heal other players. Maybe. Hey, there's someone here. Maybe it's the tutorial receptionist. Close enough. It's wonderful to meet you, adventurers. My name is Bouquet. It's really annoying that the music is kind of drowning her voice out. 
I really wish I could have changed that. Ah. I am a guardian spirit, a royal geist, sent by the goddesses, those who guard this world, known as Allsgard, in order to guide your path. As I maintain the chronicle of this land, allow me to explain the story of this place and... Oh, oh my! Oh dear, oh my! <laughs> what the hell, Vert? Come on, what the hell? Oh dear, oh dear. What? What an absolutely adorable girl! My dear, how would you like to become my younger sister? Yeah, yeah. What? My vision is filled with bouncy, bouncy. Bouncy, bouncy. Chill out, Bert. What in the world are you doing? You've given the poor girl a nosebleed. Ugh, bouncy, bouncy? You gotta be freaking kidding me. <sighs> no, calm down, Mom. I can't let something so stupid get to me. Yes, like, like the volume of the music getting to me. I, I can't let it get to me. It's fine, I can sort it later. Wait a minute. She's an NPC, but she's reacting to the player's actions in real time? Some kind of AI. <laughs> so you've noticed. This is another one of the elements in the game that I was becoming very excited about. What? I, I can't hear you over the music. That element is the game's communication system. NPCs in this world are equipped with a very powerful AI that has the ability to learn. What? So that means you can just talk normally with a character and they'll carry on a conversation with you? <laughs> That's super cool! Doesn't Planetune specialize in communication AI? How are you not familiar with this? It, it's Nep. about that, but Planetune's technology is number one in game industry, so that makes sense. Number one? You know Last Station's tech is unparalleled in basically every other area. Uh-huh. Hm. Tech aside, Louis is certainly the best. We have a long history of supporting a wide range of citizens, from children to the elderly. Now, now, the real world is currently irrelevant. I really want to hear her voice more clearly. Please, game, let me get to the menu. Vert, you're coming on way too strong. Okay, are you all right? But, but, but my ideal vision, my dream of a little sister has finally appeared before my eyes. No, Vert. Down. No. Down, Vert. Just calm down. Let's listen to what she has to say. I hate it when these games do that to me. It's like I can sort of tell who the voice actress is, but I, I'm not 100% because I can't hear them over that music. Long ago, four goddesses descended from the divine realm into this empty world. Purple Heart, the goddess of fate. Black Heart, the goddess of prosperity. White Heart, the goddess of order. Order? Yeah, makes sense. Yeah, he, yeah, definitely makes sense. The four goddesses created this world and named it Allsgard. They vowed to protect it. This land is home to the world tree, Greenbridge, otherwise known as the Tree of Life. It is the source of this world's magical power. Its roots spread all across Allsgard, giving life to all things, from the smallest insects to the largest animals. All life was born from Greenbridge. Lean Verde. I like, yeah, I like it. It's a name I can say. A thousand years ago, the goddesses sealed away an invader from the demon realm called the Demon King Jester. He attempted to steal Lean Verde's magic but was defeated. Demon King Jester? The battle took its toll, and the goddesses had to leave Osgore. They created the sacred treasures in which their remaining power was bestowed. 
They told the royal geist of that age, my great great grandmother, when the world is in danger once again, those carrying our blessings shall appear. Grant them the sacred treasures and call to us. Keep guard of the treasures until that time comes. They retreated to the divine realm and slumbered. We guardian spirits have kept this story close to our hearts. We've passed it down to our descendants for generations. And now, the ones who have received the blessings of the goddesses have arrived. Yes, you all. You are the chosen ones. My god. It is your duty to gather the sacred treasures at Tetu Temple to revive the four goddesses. You must stop the resurrection of the Demon King. I, I think I can do that one. Tetu Temple. T Tetu. I mean, have you seen some of the box art? Uh, clearly not. Clearly not. Defeating a demon king, huh? It sounds like a classic fairy tale. It feels exciting to go through a story like this for once. Now that we know the final boss, where should we go first? You mentioned several names that all sounded rather important. Yes. Past this forest is the city of Wishuel, which is a base for all adventurers. Wish, wish you well. So wish you well. All right. At the heart of the city lies a sacred place called Cottle Prim Cathedral, where the goddesses are revered. Please head there first. It started so well with names I could pronounce, and now it's like Cottle Prim. Hmm, I see. Even in this game, it seems to be a very important building. We understand. Thanks for giving us all that info. Just watch, we're gonna clear the first dungeon in no time. Yes, of course. I wish you all the best of luck. Thank you very much. This forest is a place to test and train adventurers. Please learn how to navigate Allsgard at your own pace. That being said, I'll be on my way. Wait a minute, Bouquet. Will we meet again? Oh dear, oh dear. That is relieving to hear. We have only just met. I do hope we are able to deepen our attention. Uh, oh my! Please go easy on me. I'm so sorry, Bouquet. You don't have to pay this lady any attention, okay? I really like Vert's voice, though. It's like the, just the slight change into a bit deeper. It's just, it's, I like it. It's funny. Vert should shut her mouth for a while. Let's focus on moving forward. I, I disagree. V Vert should carry on. She, she's good. She's good. How regrettable. I suppose it cannot be helped. All right. Let us head to the cathedral in Wishuel. Wishuel indeed. Yeah! Let's get pumped! We'll see you soon, Bouquet! No, 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 no. We get pumped in Senran Kagura PBS. Not, not in this. Yes, indeed. Well, gameplay. Uh oh. About the mini map. The mini map is located in the upper right area of the screen. It displays information about the map as it relates to the player's current location in the dungeon. Oh, we got little icons. Okay. Information important to advancing the story, such as areas where events will occur or enemy location, is also just that's worded weirdly is also displayed via various icons on the minimap. When using warp points, be aware that bosses may appear right after warping. In such cases, the player cannot leave the dungeon until the boss is defeated. 
Icons marking locations for specific items or treasure chests are not generally displayed on the minimap. They will, however, appear when using a certain item. Okay. Right, head to the destination. So just push forward. Doggo! I found a monster already! It's time to show my stuff! Just so you know, it's your own fault if you waste all your energy too soon. Don't come asking me for help later either. Again, waiting for the subtitles? You say that you are, but can you even keep up with me? I'm a pro. <sighs> now you've done it! You'll never outgame me, Neptune. Not in a million years! Well, just don't die out there. You can leave the healing to me. Now, everyone, let us begin the battle. Very well. So on the start menu. I know I get the start menu after this tutorial. I want to target, but it doesn't let me target. There we go. So I knew I knew I could target, but it wouldn't let me do it yet because it hadn't taught me that. Locking onto an enemy will display their HP and break gauges. When their break gauge is depleted, they will become susceptible to massive damage. Yes, you hit its weak spot for max massive damage. Yes. Elements the enemy is susceptible to are displayed under the weakness. So we got fire, ice, lightning, wind. Okay. Attacking an enemy's weak point will inflict more damage and sometimes cause status effects. Party members and enemies can acquire status effects during battle. If a party member is afflicted with a status effect, they can be healed with certain items. Okay, right, so once we've got- Whoa! That's God then. How did I ever figure out all this in the Japanese version when I did that little... Twit look at it. I, I think I was just messing around. Right, we don't do a perfect God here. Got ya. Right, use items. Right, we've done that. Right. L1 for a skill. All right, can I target it? Then skill. All right, so let's use fire. Da da da. Slice. And fire. There we go. Hold the L1 button and press the square, X, triangle, or circle buttons to use attack or healing skills. Uses SP. Switch between skill sets with the up and down directional buttons. All right, fair enough. Head to the warp point. Right, so if I can do that, so up and down. No, I've, not, I've not got any different ones yet from the looks of it. We've got two skill sets, but no. Head to the warp point. Yeah, we got the start menu. We got it. I need to cough. Hold on a sec. I I got too excited about the start menu, and like air got caught in my throat. That wasn't good. That wasn't nice. About the start menu. Pressing the options button will open the menu. Change equipment or view your status from here. Assign skills available in each skill set from within the menu. New skills are learned by leveling up. Members of your party will use skills available to them via their skill sets. Don't forget to set whatever skills you prefer they use during battle. Hmm. Higher, why did I do that? Higher stats? I don't know. That was weird. Why did I do that? Higher stat- I, I think it's because it's currently 4 a.m. this morning. I'm a bit hyper because I haven't slept. Yeah. Anyway. Higher stats correlate to stronger skills. Strength or orientated attack skills lower HP more, and int orientated skills are more effective in reducing the break gauge. Good to know. Right, can, can I- can I turn down? Can I turn down? Config. Right. Yay! Finally! Finally. Let's turn this down to 75. Right. This, I, I know Nep says stuff when I do this. Test, test, one, two. Hey, can you hear me? Oh, yes. Test, test, one, two. Hey, can you hear me? Yes. Right, so we've got camera distance. We'll have it out as far as possible. Speed fast. I don't know about reverse just yet. Sometimes it's backwards. Sometimes it's uh, you, you know how it is. You know how it is. Um. Oh, I don't know about that just yet. What enhance maybe on that? I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to change the buttons. So back that up. Change these settings. Yes. That was the trouble I was having on the Japanese version. I couldn't get through that. Can I not change like the? 
like the, the, the speed of the text. Doesn't seem to be anywhere to change the speed of the text. Oh, does there? Is that another option somewhere else? Adventure? Vendigus Records? No, I don't really care about that right now. Status? There's nep. Hmm. Yes, yes. Uh, customize, maybe? No, that's customized equipment and stuff, isn't it? Yeah, so, I'd, yeah, I don't think we can... Maybe in the chat? Hello? 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 Anybody? Help. Help. Right, so... Oh, God. Is the chat always going to stay there? I hope not. I'm just looking at the top left now. Ooh, we actually got stuff come up on the side. I'm gonna... What? Was... Is that the Doku noise? It's like... La, 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 la. That, I timed that actually really well. That was weird. Let's change the settings on that. We, we don't want that messing around all the time up there, do we? We just want it diminished. So after time, it'll disappear, I assume. So we'll change that. Oh, that, that, it's at the bottom. That's good. Right, so... The bottom's always good, isn't it? Yes, yes. Right, so let's take out some fish. Always got to take out these fish. Let's go with fire. The only problem with it being this far out is like I can't see where things are. That's that's the issue. Let's go get the shiny. Right, so let's have another mess around in the cafe. I want to get it. Just, you want to get that feeling of getting it right, don't you? So, what did I want to change? My camera, how far out I am. Three is probably actually better. Than, oh, duh. I, I still did that. I did that in the Japanese version. I had trouble getting there. So, it, yeah, because it feels like I can't see what I'm doing if I'm not far, that far out with the skills. Oh, about using items. View the items currently held by selecting items from within the menu. Add consumable items to your item set to use these within dungeons. I'll sort that later. I want to get all these shinies as quickly as possible. I've got to get these shinies. Inspect. I picked this up. Indeed you did. I'm going to get a chest. I picked Another chest, because I want to see if she does the... Da-da-da-da. Because I know she did in the Japanese version. So let's see. This treasure's mine. I want a... Da-da-da-da. Let's just go normal attacks here. See if that works out for us. da 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 Da, 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 da. Might need to turn up the um, sound effects a bit, because it, it feels like they're they're a bit out of whack as well. Just 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 a bit too little, for what we're hearing. All right, so let's have a go at that. Let's take you out and see if that works. Gotta remember to defend. That would help, wouldn't it? There we go. That that worked out nicely. It's hard to line up there. It's like, get get on the... Inspect! Like, I, I'm pressing the di direction towards the item, and it's like, wandering around weirdly. It's bizarre. Thank you. Thank you, Nep. I, I, I can rest easy now. That was going to bug me. That was going to bug me so much if you didn't do that in this. Because then I'd have to say, like, well, that's better in Japanese. I, I don't want to do that. Because I prefer the dub. The dub is much better. Did it say, did it say Nya? I think it did. I'm trying to see what's best to play around with here. Let's take out this fish. It's a tulip fish. The worst kind of fish. You don't want to eat those. They don't taste nice. They don't taste nice. Tastes a bit flowery somehow. I'm probably later in their life cycle or something like that. Right, let's take out this goblin, or whatever it is. What is it? It is a goblin! Alright then. Alright, so if there's fire. Oh, is it an up slice? Can't see! There. Alright, let's get this shiny. Get the chest open. And then we'll head on to the event. Glasses! Oh yes, of course! I can actually mess around with that now, can't I? So equipment, costumes maybe? Might be in there. I don't know how I got to it on the Japanese version again. But the glasses there, so edit. 
So move mode. So we'll do what we did last time. Put them there. How did I move them out? This is the thing. I did all this accidentally on the Japanese version. So it's like, I don't know what I did. I'll resize them. There we go. Don't worry. I'll, I'll, I'll just do it for like this little bit. And it's like later we'll change it. Don't worry. Don't worry. There we go. We got, we got glasses. I, I don't know. I don't know. Hey, does anyone see the exit? I feel like I'm getting a good handle on the controls. Yikes! What was that? Oh dear. It seems we have a guest. Are we starting the boss battle? Well, <laughs> it's only the first dungeon, so I'm sure we'll be fine. Why, yes, our bare hands would be more than enough for a tutorial boss. Yeah, yeah, that's very nice and all, but please fight with your weapons! My instincts are telling me to go in swinging against the boss. But for now, I'll do my best to help with support. Is everyone ready? Let's go! Indeed! We're not going, by the way. We're gonna end this part here, and in the next part, we'll actually go off and face the boss that's obviously through there. So, oh, well that went well, didn't it? So, we'll see you in the next part. Goodbye. For now.